what is up guys laser here uh, bringing you some more snipper gameplay um, here on the turbine um, um, I guess I can just this is pretty lazy commentary um, I really wanted to talk about traffic points and kill zones in turbine but um, I think it's important for, for me anyway to start off and go ahead and tell you guys that tomorrow is my birthday yes tomorrow I am turning 19 and it is kind of that birthday where you want to be happy about it but you really don't know what to do at all uh, it's not really a special birthday um, I, I mean you don't really get it to do anything I mean it's not your 16th birthday you know when you first get your license or your 18th birthday when you can you know first you know go to a club or something you know I'm not like I really I do that stuff anyway but I mean there's all there's also there's there's a mark for every birthday you know like a, like a milestone well, this one is not really a milestone but still you know I you know happy to be another another year older and uh, I'd really like for my birthday I really like to have 30 more subscribers I, I think it's a reasonable goal for 30 more subscribers uh, to hit you know 1100 subscribers because I'm stuck at that 1070 and I'd really like if we could just you know pump up the game here so if you guys could do a little advertising for me that would be much appreciated and um, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and kick it in gear with the Call of Duty stuff, cause I know you derps out there are just like, Ray is this dude talking about his Call of Duty birthdays? I don't care. I want him to talk about Call of Duty. Okay, okay we're talking about Call of Duty now. I dropped 30 kills in this game and I die four times. Don't worry, all four deaths happen pretty much in in the same order, so it does get boring at first but it it gets a lot better I'm pretty sure I'm done dying now uh, if I'm wrong so help me oh god okay now I'm done dying and so uh, turbine turbine is like a map that you just automatically oh we see the sandiness oh we see the terrorists around oh we see the plane god forbid no one snipes on this map this is automatically a sniping map right well in my opinion it can be used as a sniping map but it's not the best sniping map to me. I don't, when I get on this map, I feel like I can do a lot better if I'm running around with an assault rifle such as the M27 Stealth Class that, that, I, uh, that I uploaded a couple of days ago. I don't think this map is amazing for sniping because you're pretty much limited to the traffic points. As you can see, this area where I'm in right, that I'm in right now is a major traffic point. And when I come up here in this little metal house, this is obviously not a traffic point. It is a high level kill zone. Everyone throws down those bouncing beddies and everything right there, and I don't want to be there. When I, I really just want to be in the traffic zones and, and, and traffic points and see if I can pick these people off before they even get a chance to get to the kill zones and, and, and get kills. You know, on, on my teammates are give my teammates the kills instead. Remember, teammates can pretty much be your worst enemy, as well as as an ally. And pretty, if you're not playing with your friends, then pretty much they are your worst enemy because they are absolutely retarded. Um, sniping on this map can be hard if you are not using, um, if you're not using one-shot kill weapons. Um, I notice a lot of people like to use the SVU on this map. I don't know why. Um, it's pretty much never a one-shot kill with the SVU. And if if you miss a kill, you if you miss a shot or, or you're vulnerable, you always have to remember that no matter where you are in this map, there is always a spot where you are vulnerable. You are always able to be seen. You are never invisible on this map. So out of the six people that you're shooting, one of them knows where you're at. So basically, I like I recommend using something powerful like the DSR, the XPR on this map, because you can take out the person and then get you know get the crap out of there before they even you know the, before they even get a chance to shoot. I couldn't imagine myself spraying away with the with the SVU and getting upset because the guy ran away before I can get another uh, another shot on him you know to confirm my kill and then everybody sees me and starts spamming me with with um with the, their their bullets from you know across the map and then I end up dying and I end up losing kill streak you know 
Not cool, bro. Not cool at all. Um, another thing on this map. Spawn points. Um, as you can see, this guy is back here camping his spawn. He doesn't know what he's doing. Uh, if you could, if you check, if you check what you're, if you check around your surroundings and you think it's safe, you can go ahead and move up in this game and you can flank people quite easily. Um, the traffic points are linked up together. This is a traffic point right here that I'm in. They are linked up together, and you can use it as an overhead against that one kill zone. You see that kill zone right there where the, where the rail is that I just threw my grenade at? My AGR, my, my bad? That is a major, major kill zone right there. I usually avoid... I usually avoid going up there as much as possible because it is just a death zone. As soon as you step there, your head is vulnerable, and you are just completely... You know, just in the wrong place. I mean, you just don't want to be there at all. I, I see a lot of my teammates run up there, and I just highly, I just really don't advise it because the spawns are already bad on this map. And all it takes is a back spawn for everyone to see you, and you know, just shoot you. You know, and, and you'll be left there, you know, lying played on the cold, uh, cold hard metal, and you'll be like, man, what gives, man? Um. What's another spot right here? Whenever they spawn, they're gonna be coming up this little hill right here. I like to snipe right here and try to go for headshots. It helps for ki for camos, and you know it also it also brings them coming back. Like, oh man, he shot me that time, but next time I'm gonna get him. You know, chances are if you're sitting there hard scrapping like I'm doing, they're not going to get you. You know. What's some more knowledge I can drop for you guys on this map? Another kill zone, the middle of the map. Um, it's where the broken planes are. That is a high level kill zone right there. Uh, if you're sniping, I do not recommend being there because you're not going to get a chance to get off your kills unless you are from phase. And so if you're an avid quickscoper and you're just really good at just shooting people before they even get a chance to breathe, then um, then yeah, by all means, go inside of the uh, go inside of the. Uh, the the actual planes and everything and, and, and camp that. Um, that's more knowledge. Anything else? Oh, that's all I got on Turbine for now, but I really am excited about my birthday. I'm trying to think exactly what I want. I'm trying to think if I should get a snowball. Well, my friend said I don't need a snowball mic, but I might just save up, you know, and, and try to get a new phone or something like that. Hmm. Yep, well that is just about it guys. If you like this video, please drop a like. It really helps me out. Please comment, please subscribe, and uh, please get, help me get more, more subscribers. I need 30 more subscribers. I really would like that for my birthday. Until next time, I'm done.